Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. Today I'm gonna do something interesting, see if I can able to fix it. Uh, I recently got a Kitchen A the uh, 6000 series or 6 series and I noticed that after I wash it using a soap with a sponge then I start to see some visible like bad dots but it looks like a mold but I don't think it's a mold because we dry up so it cannot be a mold. So now I want to give a try and wash it um, using a baking soda that I got and make it into a paste see nice and see if I can wash it off. It says the baking soda can be washed over the uh, stainless steel on the uh, the back of the uh, the bag. So I'm gonna try I use I start with half a cup first with couple of tablespoon of water to make a paste and then wash it off so I make about half a cup looks like it yeah I hope that will solve the problem let me try add two tablespoon of water and see if it turn into the paste yeah it looks like the paste is not not enough to paste let me add another tablespoon of water Kitchen A forms. It says that it might be my situation might be the uh, stainless steel, the metal, uh, not stainless steel, the polish uh, left over that could not be washed off. So they are suggesting to use either salt with lemon or a baking soda paste to wash it off. So eventually I'm going to use my hand shortly. So let me add another half a cup of baking soda powder and then mix with another three tablespoon of uh, big, uh, the water so I hope this will solve my issue because this is new that's impossible to have all this bad that just a first time washing you know so I think the more I noticeable is at the bottom so I'm gonna spend more time at the bottom make sure it does um, clean it out because I don't want those things on my food when I try to do something on it using this mixer. I haven't washed it off yet but when I push the over the baking soda I don't see the black dot anymore. I hope that's the case after I wash it off and that would be a easy self issue. Washing the residual um, metal polishing that cannot be washed off completely during the manufacture. Yeah, I still see a little bit spot here. I'm going to do the same thing. Add another half a cup and then three drops of water and clean those spots. So I believe the uh, Kitchen A should write something on the manual or additional separate paper. I think additional separate paper would be fine because I personally myself, I don't read the uh, instruction, instruction manual. If I don't have to, but if you have a separate paper saying that you need to wash it through baking soda for the before you start using, that would be helpful, you know. Yeah, I cleaned it. The last remaining spot that I missed out earlier is all clean now. After I scrubbed it, here is very smooth. So I guess I fixed my problem. It's all good now. No more ducks. So it solved my issues very simply that everyone can do at home. Thank you for watching and I'll see you the next video.